Namphia data reveals just how close Namibia is to reaching the UN 8990 targets, which require 90% of the population to be tested, 90% of people infected to be on HIV treatment, and that 90% of HIV positive people on treatment to be considered virally suppressed. Namibia has reached and exceeded two of the three targets, that is treatment and viral suppression. Namphia results show us that Namibia is very close to this milestone. Specifically, we are at uh, 86, 96 and 91%. This means that uh, with your continued support of the ministry's HIV program, uh, additional people with HIV can be identified and placed on treatment. The one target that Namibia is slightly lagging behind is men who are unwilling to be tested. We have to change our operational model in order to find men or men to come in for testing. One of the things I was thinking is to make women our agents, especially young women, that when you come for the test, you must insist that your male partner must also test. In countries supported by the U.S. President's emergency plans for AIDS relief, PEPFAR, Namibia currently leads in terms of being close to achieving all these targets. Namibia, Namibia can and should be celebrating the results so far. We can't lose sight of the areas of concern. There are many disparities within the HIV epidemic in Namibia. I've already talked about the vulnerability of Namibia's girls and young women, but so too are young men. Namphia is a household survey and was conducted last year throughout the country. Salima Henok, NBC News, Ventuk.